What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Filmora Mastery, and this is a step-by-step -step complete guide of how to use the multi-camera editing feature in Filmora 14. Multi-camera editing is going to make it easy for you if you are going to edit an interview or whatever the video that you shot using two cameras, two or more camera angles. If you have that kind of a project, this video is really, really for you. So you select all of them right here, select all of these right here, and then write select. And then you are going to see this option right here, which is create a multi-camera. So right here, you are going to see this option where you are supposed to name your multi-camera sequence. So I'm going to name this one right here. This option below here is for you to choose which method are you going to use to sync all of your clips, you know? So usually you use the audio if all of your clips have got the audio. But in this case, just for this example, there are no audio in these video clips. So let me just use this other method right here, which is the frame, just the first frame. They all start at the first frame, okay? So when you select this one right here, your clips are going to be in the timeline just like a compound clip, you know? You remember the compound clips. So we had that lesson on this video showing up there. So now all your clips have been made like a compound clip and they are right here in the timeline when you open the compound clip using this option right here. And you find out all your clips are here, three of them, you know. But this is not where you are going to edit your multi-camera sequence. So let's move back to the main timeline. You can see if you look exactly right on the top of your preview screen, you are going to see right here that there are two options. The other one, of course, is the video scopes. But this other option right here is the one that we are talking about here. And this is the option for the multi-camera view. And right here, my dear friend, the very first thing that I would like to draw your attention to is this option right here. So this is actually an option for you to change or see the audio source. Which video are you taking the audio from? If I select here, I'm going to find that there are three options. The reason is... I have added three video camera angles here. That's why I have three options to take audio from. And right here on top here, you're going to see that this is where you are going to edit. So the method is simple right here. You just have to start playing your compound clip, your video, or your, your multi-camera sequence. We better call it that way. So right now, as it is playing, you just choose which angle or which camera video do you want to prefer right now. And then by selecting it, you're actually cutting into that. Okay, I can just select this number two here, and then it shows up here. And then again, number three. So as you can see right here, my dears, everything that I am selecting on the left side is showing up on the right side. And right here, when you are done, you can just disable the multi-camera view, and right down here on your timeline, you're going to find out that your multi-camera sequence, which is your compound clip, has been cut into pieces, which are the cuts that you were selecting during the multi-camera editing. Well, fellow editors, if you found it helpful, go ahead and subscribe to help the growth of this channel. But wait before you leave. What about getting some cool tricks of using compound clips in Filmora? Well, check out this video right here.